1916, at the brink of World War I, a young 20-something soldier from West Virginia who had just enlisted in the military just a few weeks earlier was called into the Army sooner than he had expected. In the few weeks between, he had become engaged to a beautiful young girl and had hoped to be married long before he was called to duty. Following brief training, he was sent to Germany, where the war was at its peak. After he had gone, his older brother persuaded the girl that the soldier had told him he didn't love her after all, and married her himself. A little more than a year later, on Christmas Eve, the young soldier received a furlough and returned home unexpectedly. It was a beautiful moonlit night as he walked the streets of his youth, but when he came to his brother's home, which stood on a hill surrounded by hemlock trees, it seemed very dark and still. The soldier knocked on the door and his brother let him in, but he was obviously less than pleased to see him. The wife was upstairs resting, for she was carrying their first child. The two of them talked for a few minutes, discussing all that had gone on in the soldier's absence. The older brother confessed that he had married the girl for her money and position in the community, and added that if the soldier interfered in any way, he would not hesitate to kill him. Both saddened and angered that his brother could do such a heartless thing, the soldier left, but returned a short while later. He once again knocked on the brother's door, and when he answered the door, the soldier pulled out his revolver and shot his brother, point blank. He then turned and walked away into the night as quietly as he had come. After hearing the shot, the young wife rushed downstairs to find her husband dying on the floor. He told her what had happened, that his brother had come to the door and shot him because he had been jealous. As the man drew his final breaths, the wife had called the police, and although they made a thorough search of the entire hillside and surrounding region, they found no trace of the soldier. The following morning, on a snowy Christmas morning, an unexpected telegram arrived, addressed to her husband. She opened it and found a chilling truth inside, and announced that the soldier had been killed in action in Germany four days earlier, on December 21st.